You realize I'm not there, right? <laughs> Hi! I'm doing a vlog and I'm not the only one that's here. Present yourself. What am I doing? When do I get when do I get here? We already did that bit. Well not yet, but you've already seen that bit. Oh right. Hi guys! Editing tricks. What? Probably a bit of spin there. Oh yeah, how did you know? <laughs> how did you know? <laughs> Hi guys, how, I'm, uh, okay. I'm no plan. I'm the northern shit from yeah. I'm Michael, Dr. Michael Ten, you should all know me by now. Is that it? Bye. Yeah, see ya. So anyway. <laughs> okay. Jump cut. But yeah, no, no jump cuts. Oh fuck oh. this shit. I will jump cut when I want to fucking jump cut. Now. What time is it? It is like quarter past eight. We're gonna do a thing because we are both about as socially awkward as each other. Or not, but that's what we're going to find out now. This is a bit formal, isn't it? Mm. I don't like this because you know it's we're both standing up. Shall we sit down? Yes. Okay. Ha! <laughs> I've got my fucking leg off. This is much less formal, isn't it? It's much yes, more relaxed. We're sat down. Much more relaxed. We're sat down doing a quiz. You've got your phone, and I've got a knife. Let's do this shit. I've not said it yet. Subscribe to my channel. For fuck's sake. Okay, so it's time to leave a party. Do you give the entire room a wave and a strident bye everyone? Bye guys. <laughs> Do you seek out the people you know best and say goodbye? You know, make up plans to meet them? Do you mumble a few half-hearted farewells before making for the door? Yeah. Or do you slope off without saying a word to anyone? I would seek out the people I know best say goodbye. I would probably, I don't go to parties, I'd stay in and edit videos, I don't know about you. Well, I, I rarely go to parties, but when I'm when I'm forced, when I'm in the situation, I, I will seek out the people I know best. Um, I'd either I'd seek out the people I know best, but if it's not one of those situations, which it probably wouldn't be, because why, why would you be there? But I'd probably just slop off without being noticed, like, oh my gosh. You find yourself sharing a lift with a work colleague you oh. don't know very well. So in, this, in your case, it's someone from, yeah. Yes. In my case, someone from. <laughs> it does. It does give. It does give you a pain in the throat when you're finished. Uh, but anyway, uh, you find yourself sharing enough with a work colleague you don't know very well. Do you inquire enthusiastic, enthusiastically about their life outside work? Engage in chit chat about the weather. Who the fuck does that nowadays? Stare at the I know, floor. No, that's just that's so cliche. Yeah. Like, how's the weather? Stare at the floor. Maintain absolute silence. All across like I'm not talking to you. <laughs> I'd do that. Uh, in quite enthusiastically about their life outside work. Ah. So if they don't ask you, you can go, bitch, that's just selfish. And if they do ask, I'll, I'll, make, up, I'll make up something funny like, I wrestled a bear today. Or, yeah, or something like, you smell like my fault victim to freak the shit out of them. Because they're in the metal box, as you said, they can't get out. On to the next one. So oh shit, are we keeping score? Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm more socially awkward at the moment because I've picked, socially, I've picked the most socially awkward option. Yes, you picked, um, well, no, was it because I had to slide off without being noticed? So I said that's 1 0 to me. But since you said uh, stay at the floor, that's 1 all. Okay, 1 1. One Fair enough. So, 1 1. Fair enough. I'm kidding, school. You're leaving work, or school, in your college. Co yes. College. You spot a colleague walking just ahead of you in the street. Do you speed up and say hi? Mm. Uh, do you pretend you haven't seen them? Do you walk. You slow your walking pace so as to put distance between them and you, or do you turn around and walk in the opposite direction, tripping over your shoelaces in the process? Um, I'd probably. I would slow my walking pace. Personally, I'd run ahead of them, but since that's not one of the closest, is slow my walking pace. Run ahead of them? Yeah. Why? I don't know. I'd just get ahead, get in front, and then. And then just flip to like, oh hey! No, just run ahead, just run past them, so you're further away from them. You're getting your hair cut. That fucking time, Mr. O. My dad cuts my hair. Mine's not been cut in ages. Um, this, this is it cut, by the way. It was longer than this. Okay, do you chat to the hairdresser the whole time? Do you exchange, exchange a few words for politeness sake and then lapse into a cheerful silence? Do you read a book or stare at your phone? Do you close your eyes and pretend to sleep? Um. I'd engage in polite chit chat and then merge into a polite, in a cheer, cheerful silence. Yeah, me too. That's so, again, that's free free. Well, we're about the same. Uh, yeah. Um, you re oh. 
You realize you're walking the wrong way down the street. Ouch. This will be fun now. Do you turn around and correct your mistake? No. Because that's just dumb. Because nah, people easy. will look at you. What the fuck's he doing the crazy shit? I'm gonna fucking knife him! Do you pretend to tie your shoelaces before turning back? Do, <laughs> do you give your phone a purposeful glance so to communicate to other observers this text changes things, I must turn back. Uh, is that I, I do that actually. I, I do. Or, or do you duck into the nearest shop and kill time until possible onlookers have moved on? Um, I, I do the phone. I do the phone thing. I'd probably duck into the shop if I haven't got my phone. Why would you not bring your phone out? What kind of teenager are you? Oh, in that case, then I'd look at my phone and go, <gasps> I look at the phone and go, <gasps> and then turn the other around. This text changes things. I must turn back. That's four four each again. Damn it! You are oh, you are called upon to introduce someone at a party, but you've realised you can't remember their name. Be honest. Say I'm sorry, I've forgotten your name. Do you make a wild guess? Do you address the person as fella or mate? I never do that anyway. Mm. Uh, do, do you run out of the room and never explain? <laughs> I I I'd be honest actually. In a very rare case of non-social awkwardness, I would be honest and say, sorry, I forgot your name. I'd run out of the room not explaining. Really? Yeah, I'd run out of the room and go, ah! Why? Because that would be Because then people just look at you more. <laughs> if, if you're going to look stupid, do it, in a, do it in a way what makes you laugh. I guess. You're stuck talking to someone boring at a party. I hate this. This has happened to me many times. Not once, mate. You, you don't go to parties, do you? I'm forced. I don't see why. Like, you're younger than me. Like, they should be like, oh, get out and socialise. But I don't, I don't. I'm staying in any videos. I want to, but then, like, for example, I went to a fancy dress party and I didn't want to. I spent the whole night on my phone. I'm gonna <laughs> sit and think about this. Do you flash a charming smile and be like, lovely to meet you, but I really must circulate? <laughs> Do you start sighing loudly, looking at your watch, hoping they'll get the message? <laughs> wow. So it's like, oh, fucking hell. Just... Wait. Or, or option D, pull out a knife and go, you know, I really want to use this. <laughs> I haven't actually found anyone yet. I'm really getting obsessed with this knife. Do you leave abruptly, muttering something about, muttering something vague about going through a lot of shit at the moment? Oh. I, I, I just... I'd be polite about it, I'd be like, you know what, I really must circulate. <laughs> I would probably actually say that as well. I don't know, I think I'd do the same as you. What, flush of mouth? Mm. So that gives you for me six points and you five points. You're more socially awkward than me, Jesus it's Christ. Fire. Um, oh, What? I hate this. This has happened to me loads of times. With six five points. You're out for dinner with friends. And everyone is telling jokes. Oh. It's your turn! Cause the friends don't dance, and if they don't dance, well, there no friends of mine. And that is the last one, so I'm. So eight. I am more socially awkward than you. Well. Well. This should get up when I'm talking to you, you fucker. This is your video. You stood up first, you do it. You do it. <sighs> That concludes the socially awkward quiz. You fucking won. Oh, shit. I'm, I'm it's not a good thing that, that I won was, though. That was socially awkward. I dropped the knife on camera. I'm, I'm not. It's not a good thing that I won though. I'm more socially awkward than you, and y you claim to be the most socially awkward person ever. It's a good point. Uh, co question for the. Co well, no, I was going to say comment for the question. Question for the commenters. Nobody who... fucking comments on my videos. You're wasting your time. Well, people who know what's in your life. People who give a shit. So you, yes, you can who, just comment. Who have yeah. watched our stuff or know us in real life? Who would you say is more socially awkward? Uh, okay. Mr. F Mr. Forsyth would probably comment because he knows both of us pretty much. Mm, you've not met him, but hello, Mr. Forsyth. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I, I am more socially well, awkward. Well, before we go, to judge on ourselves, how on like, what will be our most I'd say our more awkwardest moments? Well, well, who we change? That's why I'm messing my words up. Who would you say is the most socially awkward out of the two of us? I'd still say me because I think you're pretty good in public. Like, I'd you, agree, you, I'd say you as well. You vlog, you know, I, I wouldn't have a good... I mean, I try, but I'm just like, eh. Yeah. 
I find it difficult to keep my own life. You did it in LA. I want all the balls, but oh, fuck, yeah. I'm gonna pull a gun on me. Yeah, but LA, vlogging in LA is kind of normal because so many YouTubers live there, so people sort of expect That's it. That's true. <laughs> so, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I know I did. I. I I'm never, I've just realised I'm, I'm shit at endings. This is another thing, see? I can't even end my own videos. Um, I have a good way to end it. Ah! Oh shit, good one!